Hi, this is Andrew from DPS, and today I want to talk to you about Direct Digital Control Systems, or DDC. So what in the world is that? Well, it's a very general term, but it tends to mean something related to building management systems, BMS, or building automation systems, BAS. So that means you've got buildings that are somewhere out in the world, and you need to monitor and control what's going on in them. Uh, really, the defining characteristic here is about geodiversity. You may only have one building, in which case it's not really spread out, but if you have more than one, they're gonna to tend to be things that are spread out across a large area that you need to keep track of, and you can't be driving around besides doing things manually. That would just be impossible. And in particular, you're gonna find that DDC systems give you control over HVAC. So as far as your, your heating, ventilation, and air conditioning, what that means is you're going to have a lot of things with scheduling, cooling windows and heating windows, just everything about how the system operates, you're gonna be able to customize that. You're also gonna get things like trending analysis. So you can go back later and see, okay, are we running our sites efficiently? Do we have any kind of a failure where, especially for any kind of a, a thing, a part of the cold chain, where you need to be keeping things below a certain temperature or above a certain temperature constantly, you need that data to tell you, yes, you successfully did that. And of course, all this is happening over the network or the internet so that you have some ability to, to talk to this equipment remotely. Now, one related topic when we talk about any kind of monitoring is SCADA. And what exactly is that? Well, that tends to be a different kind of thing. That's going to be common in manufacturing. It's common in water treatment, or wastewater. And what all of these SCADA type systems share is it's not really spread out across such a large area. You tend to have a high density of sensors and inputs and outputs and all kinds of things that are giving you information about your process. But unlike a direct digital control system or DDC, you're not really going across such a large area. Now, it is important though, to note that when people say SCADA, about 10% of the time that they're searching online in the way that you probably are for SCADA information, they tend to mean DDC or general telecom remote monitoring. And that's important to understand because there can be that overlap there and you just really need to, to understand when that's the case. So why is it that we're providing this information? Well, DPS is a manufacturer of remote monitoring and control gear. And since you're doing research, you may need something like this. It might be a little more of a DDC flavor. It might be more SCADA. But whatever the case, it's possible that, one, you can use our equipment, which I'll explain to you here in a moment. You might need equipment, but it might be more like that true SCADA. Maybe you're in manufacturing or wastewater, something like that, and you actually need a different kind of monitoring, but we're still here to help you. And lastly, you might be a student doing a term paper. We actually see a lot of that. If that's the case, please use the information on the website and uh, I hope it can be helpful for you. So if you do possibly need DPS equipment, what might that mean? Well, it's gonna be just mostly two different product lines. You're gonna have RTUs, which are the little devices that you'll put out, out at each building that you have to collect information from sensors and issue control commands and do all the things that you need to do remotely. And we call those net guardians mostly, but we also have some specialized models that tend to be uncreatively named after their function. Uh, we have the HVAC controller, for example, that would do much of the HVAC control uh, functions that I talked about earlier. And then second, you have a second product line, which is the central master stations or your head end. And you're going to have one of these for your entire operation. That will be mostly called a Timon if you were to buy it from us. But importantly, uh, unlike some companies that are out there, we don't restrict you to using that team on just because you want to use, say, our Net Guardians. The Net Guardians will report SNMP to any SNMP manager, and you also have support for some other protocols if you need that. So that's a little bit of a whirlwind overview of what in the world a direct digital control system is, what SCADA is, and I hope that helps you flesh out your understanding as you continue to do your research. If you need our equipment or not, please uh, don't hesitate to reach out. You can give us a call. You can use the contact forms or web chat on our website, and we'll get you connected with an expert as you continue your project.